I would consider myself a real family man. And after you've heard my story that I submitted to this channel, you're going to find out that I'm a real family man. Anyways, here goes. I'm 62 years old and these days a very happy old man. My son married his wife four years ago. She's a beautiful 30 year old. Well, at the time of me submitting the stories, she's 30 years old with short black hair, perfect boobs and green pretty eyes. My wife is 65 years old and me and her don't have sex anymore. Really and truly, me and wife haven't had sex for the past 12 years. And boy, I really missed it. Anyways, along comes my daughter-in-law. I haven't found myself a good company in her until she arrived. She shared so many interests with me, particularly our tastes in movies, alcohol, music, and best of all, politics yeah i love talking about politics let me cut a long story short as my daughter-in-law and son began having problems in their marriage about a year after getting married she began frequenting my house often to talk things out to vent her anger and you know to distract herself i wasn't trying to seduce her and probably she wasn't doing any such thing either but these visits brought us closer and closer, really closer, and I mean really, really close. During our first time, we got pissed drunk in the basement of my home, and while my wife was upstairs sleeping, we got very drunk and we had sweet, hot, steamy sex in July, two years ago, and oh boy, that was really something. It was the best July of my 62 years on this earth so far. We had sex so many times in my house, at a motel, at the home that she and my son shares. Boy, it was really good. We still have sex often, very often actually, even after things between her and my son had improved greatly. I'm not a very good looking guy myself. And to think that someone like her would love having sex with someone as fat and old as me, it really was, it really, really was, I'm really short for words. It was like my wildest dreams. We even almost got caught once. We were having sex in the guest room at my son's house in the afternoon when he suddenly came home early and knocked on the door. I answered the door in a towel, sweaty with sex, while my daughter-in-law hid behind the door. She was completely naked. Luckily, my son didn't come in. I told my son that I was exercising and that his wife was actually out running some errands. After that, he left. We locked the door again and continued having sex as my son went to the living room to watch one of his NFL games. The very thought that my, um, while my son was there waiting for his wife, I was there having sex with her and it got me so over the edge sexually excited. She told me that when she had sex with my son, they always wore a condom, but while me and her are having sex, she never insists on me wearing one. That's why I got a bit concerned and worse. She's now eight months pregnant. She says that she's certain that the child is mine. And she also convinced my son into thinking that one of the condoms may have become defective while she and him were having sex. I never did wear a condom when I had sex with my daughter-in-law. But up until a year ago, I never came inside of her either. But since then, I've always had it. I can't explain what I really feel about her. I really don't want to reveal too much in this story, but to hell with it. This is for the good of the channel. I love my daughter-in-law a lot, but she reserves 
the married love for my son. Regarding me, she's honest though. She says that she has a sexual compatibility with me that she has never had with my son. There's love too there, I guess, but it's more like a sexual release. I don't care. I'm old. I'm just happy for the sex that I'm getting. I'm more than actually happy. I'm freaking happy. In March, I will welcome my granddaughter into this world. Or should I say, my daughter. Names and locations with hell. Leave a comment below and tell us what you think of this confession guys also subscribe to my channel for more videos